Welcome to Learn with Priyanka. Question 97. You have a fabric warehouse that contains a table named Sales Products. Sales Products contains the following columns. You need to write a TSQL query that will return the following columns. How should you complete the code? To answer, select the appropriate options in the answer area. This is a simple and straightforward TSQL query. The correct answer is here. First, for the highest selling price column, we want to return the highest value among three prices, list price, wholesale price, and agent price. To achieve this, the correct function to use is greatest. This function compares the values and gives us the highest one. Other options like coalesce, IIF, or max aren't suitable here because coalesce returns the first non-null value among its arguments, but does not compare their values. IIF, a conditional function, not suitable for finding the highest value. And max, works on aggregate data in a group, not for comparing values within a single row. Next, for the trade price column, our goal is to return agent price if it exists. If not, we move to wholesale price. And if that's also null, we fall back to list price. The perfect function for this logic is coalesce which returns the first non-null value in the sequence. Using choose. Returns the item at the specified index from a list of values in SQL Server, which does not meet the condition of prioritizing agent price, then wholesale price, and finally, list price. IIF. A conditional function that requires a true-false condition, making it less suitable for this purpose. Max. Again. This function aggregates data and is not suitable for this purpose. See you with another question. Make sure to like, share and subscribe for more videos.